Hi, this is Michael Pariente of the Pariente Law Firm PC here at the Howard Hughes Center in my conference room, and I am joined by the most distinguished DUI lawyer in the entire state of Nevada. That is not an exaggeration, and I'm proud to say that Mr. John G. Watkins, sitting to my left, is now going to be of counsel with our firm. We're thrilled, and I just want to take a moment to say thank you, John, for giving us this opportunity to work with you. And if you could tell us a little bit about yourself. Well, first off, I want to thank you for uh, inviting me to associate with you. Uh, and the reason I've done that is because I respect your legal work. I know that you filed two writs with the United States Supreme Court. Very few attorneys uh, do that. Uh, I have done it probably eight times, okay. Um, thank you. A little bit of uh, background on myself. I'm a 37-year lawyer here. Uh, more particularly, uh, I became very well known during the Jessica Williams case, the young lady who had fallen asleep after having smoked some marijuana at the Valley of Fire, and there were six uh, young uh, adults that were killed in the accident. And uh, it was a nationally televised trial. Um, I had uh, uh, a lot on the plate. We were able to get six counts of uh, not guilty manslaughter, six counts not guilty of reckless driving, six counts of not being impaired. Jessica Williams is in jail because she had just a trace amount in her system without any impairment. And that's what I find to be most upsetting, and that's what I've been fighting for since her case. Um, but um, so I'm still not finished. I'm still uh, talk to Jessica all the time, and it uh, looks like the Nevada Supreme Court is going to be set an oral argument in this particular case. That's great. And speaking of the Nevada Supreme Court, you've had a number of published opinions, right? Well, uh, they know me quite well, Michael. Uh, I have had uh, over 80 cases filed at the Nevada Supreme Court by myself, and no one does my work but myself. And uh, I have approximately 60 reported opinions in the law book. In fact, we just got one two weeks ago that changed law in the state of Nevada. It requires now uh, all people who are going to be testifying uh, to analysis of whether it be drugs, alcohol, uh, they're going to have to be at least one certified as an expert in a court. A very monumental decision by the Nevada Supreme Court. I've been to the United States Supreme Court, been to the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals over 20 times. Um, you can tell by the hair, I've been around. <laughs> All right. Well, it's a pleasure to have you here, and we're looking forward to working together with you. I think we're going to do a lot of good for people who come to Nevada and get a DUI, and, and I'm really looking forward to it. I'm honored, and we're going to be seeing a lot of each other, I'm sure. Yes, we are, Michael. And uh, as you well know, I always uh, carry uh, in my pocket the United States Constitution. This is a document we can never, never let get away from us. And I am an avid supporter of the Constitution, and everybody's entitled to their constitutional rights in a trial. Absolutely. And of course, if you have been arrested for a DUI, you know where to call now, especially with John G. Watkins here, 702-966-5310. If you're calling from out of state, just give us a call. We can talk to you over the phone. If you're here in Las Vegas, come sit down with us, and we're more than happy to talk to you about what we can do for you. I need a